moved by the enforcement directorate in the liquor policy case the agency has now arrested the businessman dinesh arora who is considered to be close to the jailed aap leader manish sisodia now this is coming even as last year the court had allowed the cbi's request to make arora as an approver in the case this was the 13th arrest in the case that has been made by the enforcement directorate let me go across to bhavtosh now bhavtosh good morning the agency which has already filed uh, five charge sheets uh, including that against manish sisodia what happened with this uh, dinesh arora that eventually led to his arrest Uh, Amit, as far as uh, Dinesh Arora is concerned, uh, he was a person of interest uh, for the agency for a very long time. Uh, yes, you are right that uh, he was an approver in the CBI case, but uh, uh, the inf uh, enforcement directorate officials have said that uh, 100 crore uh, alleged kickbacks that was uh, that were paid uh, to Aam Aadmi Party went uh, through Dinesh Arora to uh, Vijay Nair, and they had in fact found a link directly, uh, which uh, clearly. it really shows that dinesh arora was a was a suspect in this case importantly they have also said that the alleged uh, kickbacks uh, of 2.2 crore rupees that was uh, given to manish sisodia also uh, went uh, through dinesh arora to amit arora and that uh, has also been mentioned in the fifth charge sheet that has been filed by the enforcement directorate though uh, aam aadmi party has completely denied uh, both these uh, charges they have also said that uh, dinesh arora was uh, present in all the meetings that were held by vijay nair who was first arrested by the enforcement directorate in september uh, of of last year uh, they have also said that uh, dinesh arora was uh, present and had held uh, various meeting uh, with the south group now the question that will be asked by everyone is that uh, why dinesh arora was arrested when he had turned approver in the cbi case uh, ed had said that they found uh, su uh, sufficient evidence to prove that he was taking proceeds of crime and their case is very different from the case that was filed by cbi but uh, cbi has officially not reacted to this development and politics will be played over this entire issue the fact that a person who was approver in the uh, cbi case has now been arrested by the uh, enforcement directorate probably the, for the first time that such a thing has happened in any case uh, that that uh, has been uh, report, uh, that has been covered uh, both by the cbi as well as by the enforcement directorate in the case who has been arrested but uh, you know will it impact the ongoing investigation bhavtosh because last year the cbi in its reply to dinesh arora's court request for protection from arrest had said that he had joined the probe and disclosed certain facts uh, which were vital for the investigation into the delhi liquor policy case Well, Amita, it could be. Uh, this could happen. Uh, his defence counsel can. Uh, uh, Sisodia's defence counsel, as well as uh, defence counsels of uh, various accused uh, that have been arrested by the uh, uh, by the Central Bureau of Investigation, can take up this uh, uh, matter before the relevant courts and say that uh, the approver has now been arrested uh, by the enforcement directorate. Uh, remember, his statement was uh, recorded under 164 CRPC before a judicial magistrate, thus making it admissible in the court of law, and uh, they. can all say that uh, he was in fact pressurized by it the... is yet to make a statement on the arrest this was the 13th arrest in the case that has been done by the enforcement directorate as uh, there has been separate investigations that has been carried out both by the enforcement directorate and also by the cbi for the moment thank you very much paptosh for joining in with those details let